this uh, video will discuss our methodology for handling divergence. Uh, divergence is a very, very powerful tool. And we look at divergence by way of one particular indicator. Now, there are four indicators on the screen. If you looked at our other videos, you know about this. But in, in particular, the indicator that we find to be especially useful for determining divergence is in subgraph 3 here. Divergence, for our purposes, is being defined as a situation where we have a higher high on the spoos but a lower high on the indicator, or a lower low on the spoos and a higher high on the indicator. Now what will help us to further confirm whether the divergence is significant enough to execute a trade has to do with our other indicators. But what we're first going to do is just show you where we have divergence. Our first instance is down here. We've got a lower low on the spoos compared to that particular bar right here but a higher low on this indicator. So anytime we have that situation, we will automatically draw a line. We have a, an indicator that will do that for us. And I'm Okay, so as we, we look at this position here, we're going to compare the price here to the price here and the value here to the value here. The indicator says we have a lower value here, that's a divergence, and therefore the trend line is automatically drawn. Are these significant enough to trade? What you don't see on this chart is the type of bar that we're running this calculation on. Let's look at this divergence for an example right here. This doesn't look like it's much, but really the low of the move there is at 1950 and it moves up to 29. That's a 10 point move, my friend. <laughs> so this, this is not anything to, to ignore. These are huge moves. Here's another divergence. Even from the low at 35, 75 and all, it drops all the way to 31. Divergence up here at 56 and 3 quarters down to a low of 52. These are big. And then again here, the top of that move, this is, this is huge. 59 drops all the way into 50. So yes, these are very, very significant divergences, even when it's not going with the trend. Look at this. Up at 50, drops all the way down to 43.75. A significant drop. So this kind of divergence really, really works. Now, the bars that we're using here move very slowly. So, while we want to keep an eye on this, because these, these can be significant opportunities for trading, it will take some time for that divergence to become obvious. So, we're going to use the same approach, but we're going to shorten the interval so that our trading becomes uh, more frequent. So we're just going to take a look at a few circumstances where we have more volatility in a shorter period of time. And we don't need these other indicators plotting in order for the divergence indicator to show up. But we just have them there to identify other aspects of our trading system that we use. 
But here we have a, an example of uh, a divergence that formed. Now you can see that a little better. All right, we're down here. It's 65 and a half. We get a nice move all the way up to 70. So that's, again, that's significant. Over here, just on, on these two bars alone, 66, all the way up to 67 and 3 quarters. Again, significant. Here's a divergence. 69 and a half drops all the way into 66. So these are bigger moves than they appear to be. Much bigger moves than they appear to be. They're significant. Nice long trade in here, 71, even at the at the uh, the high of that bar, 71, 75, takes her all the way up to 75. This form of divergence works, even even when the when when the divergence is working against the trend. You have profitable trades here. Let's just grab this one, 58, up to 60 and three quarters. Okay, so our indicator works. It's an excellent tool and you can pull very profitable trades off of this particular form of divergence. So that's our quick video on divergence. It's a great, great tool. We love it. It's, it's a perfect way to uh, uh, pick up uh, several excellent trades. Now these are not scalps, by the way. Uh, the, these are you know significant trades that, that can uh, make a meaningful impact on your bottom line. This is Rod Kusin and Spoo Man for Risk.